worst thing about knowing someone really well? There aren't any surprises. First, the helicopter arms, followed by the forehead smacking, yelling over each other, pleading. Oh, what's the big deal? You looking after your sister. That's not a big deal. Wait, you promised and that is a big deal. Memory loss. I do not remember promising any such thing. Read this. Electricity. Not action. that. Don's school reunion, Layla watching Taylor. <laughs> that doesn't prove anything. What's this? My signature. Exactly, you're staying home with Taylor. But then I can't go to the movies with Matt. You can go to the movies with Matt anytime. End of discussion, Layla. <sighs> Finally, door slamming. No surprises. Layla! Are you sure that goes there? A hundred interesting facts about Roman plumbing. A hundred, that's a little. A hundred more interesting facts about Roman plumbing. Give me the glue, would you? What am I, a slave? You know the ancient Romans wouldn't have survived without slaves. Plus. Hey, how's it getting along? Good. Are you sure that goes there? Yes. Where's the chimney? The ancient Roman kitchens didn't have oh, God, time to go. Because... Yeah, okay, I'm on my way. Be good, eh? Ew! <laughs> Matt, stop it. My face is seriously aching. <laughs> oh, stop it, Matt. She's really got it bad this time. The talking bug. The love sickness. Oh, there. Oh, I miss you too. No, I miss you more. I miss you more. <clears throat> Man, I wish I could be there too. Uh -oh. I did ask. Then they want me out of this zoo. Uh -oh. I don't know. I could write you a letter. <laughs> no, but we can talk on the phone. I can text you. Excuse me for a minute, Matt. There are microwave dinners in the freezer, and we have the mobile phone with us if you need anything. I okay. won't. Be good, sweetie. Dad, ew! Sorry, Matt. Where were we? <laughs> Seriously, stop it. He's going. I can't help it. The light is so pretty. Been working on that part for hours. I want to get it right. You've got it right. Twice. Taylor, the singer's due on Monday. We need to get it finished. Which is why you should hurry up. <sighs> when do you dorks want dinner? We're not dorks. Blunt. Love you too, Taylor. <sighs> nice lipstick, by the way. Can you make up your minds? I'm not your slave, you know. You know the ancient Romans wouldn't have functioned without... I thought being in love was supposed to make you feel good. Apparently. Layla, baby. I was really looking forward to seeing you tonight. It really seems like she's in love this time. Yeah, she'll get over it. She always does. I just don't want her to get hurt. Oh, she's a trooper, love. Besides, Matt seems a nice enough kid. Yeah, maybe you're right. Layla, want some juice? I said, do you want some juice? Taylor, I've finished the pipes. Now, if you can help hey, me. Hey, Look. What's she doing? I don't know. Maybe she's thinking. Layla, baby. I was really looking forward to seeing you tonight. But you can't come, so I'm going out with Montana instead. You're dumped. No! <laughs> Do something. I Me, mean, she's your sister. You're supposed to understand her. You've done first aid. Yeah, I don't think the ambulance course covered crying girls. Pain relief then. Yeah, I'll put a band-aid on her broken heart, shall I? Heck, you're not helping. Give her a hug. What? Give her a hug. 
I read somewhere that hugging people releases happy chemicals, like the repellent they use on dogs. <laughs> <There. laughs> Got any more bright ideas, genius? <laughs> you smell that? Layla. Now, can you fix the model? It's paper mache, Hector. We'll have to start again. Oh, silly me. Why didn't I think of that? Oh, yeah, because it's due on Monday. I can't possibly do it by then. You could if you weren't such a perfectionist. And I'm starving. You know I can't think when I'm hungry. You know, none of this would have happened if Matt hadn't have dumped her. <laughs> Don't stop now. You're on a roll. <laughs> Layla, I'm sorry. I won't mention him again. <laughs> He's a loser if you can't see what he's missing out on. Really? Really. Now here, eat. <laughs> Project's due Monday, Taylor. What are we gonna do? Apart from die of starvation. Well, I'm about to order pizza. You can either stay here and look after Layla, or you can go over to Brittany's and borrow some materials. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I think you'll find that there were ten litre drinks down. I'm sure that there were five, Michael. Um, that oh, that can be five. What are you going to do with five litres of wine? The book well, that's says just ten... ridiculous. How can anyone drink that much wine? Mother, Dad. Dad. All of my research clearly oh, indicates please. that they were... Mum! Dad. Hector has come over to borrow some materials for the Roman Kitchen Project. Hi, Hi Hector. Hector. As you can see, we're all very involved in the project. Aren't we, Leon? Yeah, it's involving. Wow. Yes. It's coming along. Aras longa vita brevis. 
It's huge. That's big on detail. No, I meant the jug. It's way too big. See? The average size of the wine jugs was 10 litres. If it was that big, Michael, how could anyone pick it up? Mum's got a point, Dad. They lifted them as slaves, OK? Lots and lots of slaves. I'll go see what spare materials I can find later. No, no, you can't eat this one. Good. You'd have to be incredibly wealthy to afford a kitchen this big. Obviously senators. Oh, who liked red wine. Lots and lots of red wine. And they had lots and lots of slaves. <sighs> Guys! Shh! OK. How would you get water from here to here? Oh, well, plumbing had to. See, the Romans invented water pipes. Oh, made out of copper. Indeed. Did I say copper? I meant to say lead. Lead? Not in this area of Rome. See, copper was much more plentiful. The Latin word for lead is plumbus. That's where the word plumbing came from. Some historians believe that lead poisoning was responsible for the fall of the Roman Empire. That's given. Fall of the Roman Empire? Smith. A hundred interesting facts about Roman plumbing. Volume one. Here we are, Hector. Better get a move on if you want to finish by Monday morning. There. I'm back! Okay, stay still, okay? Okay, Taylor, there's heaps of stuff. I mean, ah! What? Nothing. Tell me. It's just your mask. It's so healthy. Mirror. <laughs> Never seen her like this. Me neither. She's almost human. Yeah. I want the old one back. You mean the mean, irresponsible, shallow, nasty one? I miss her. We need help. Yeah, someone older, wiser. Yoo-hoo, lovey! <laughs> oh, hello, lovey. Marge. I was just driving by and I had a premonition. My numbers were about to come up in the lotto. Can I watch the results on your telly? Uh, sorry, Marge, TV's broken. Oh, trapped. Um, but can I get your advice on something? Not boy trouble. Yeah, how'd you know? The gift, lovey. The gift. Now, is he in your class? Not my boy trouble, Marge. It's Layla's. She's been dumped. Oh, no worries, lovey. I know the magic words. Oh, you look terrible. <laughs> Hector, go! <laughs> Marge, is there anything else you'd like to say, Marge? Maybe something that will help fix her broken heart? Oh, I'm with you, lovey. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. The boy of her dream is just around the corner. Could you be more specific? Uh, brownish hair, uh, average height, oh, cute smile, comes bearing gifts. Pizza delivery. You saw him coming, didn't you? Only in my mind's eye, Taylor. My mind's eye. Ooh. Hawaiian? <gasps> I was right. Yeah. Bye. Um, <laughs> that'll be $22, thanks. Sean, right? Uh, Sebastian? Uh, Sam? Stan? It's Dave, actually. Oh. Um, you might know me as Sparky. Sparky, that's it. I know it started with an S. Um, where do I know you from? Well, I used to go out with Layla. Oh. Your dad's the electrician. Yeah, that's the one. Oh. So, uh, how is Layla? Heartbroken, bawling, eyes popping out of her head, really snotty. Beautiful. So, what happened between you two again? She dumped me. Ah. Uh. It's a pity, really, because I thought we were so great together. She used to love the way I made her smile. You made her smile. Can you stay here for a second? I, I'm just going to go get Layla. I'm sure she'd love to see you. Yeah, sure. Smell something. Pizza! Got a visitor. 
<gasps> Matt? Um, no. It's, it's Dave. Remember Dave? Sparky? Oh, Sparky. Yeah, I dumped him. He was really nice. Then why'd you dump him? For Matt? <laughs> Pizza. You want some? Yeah, sure, why not? What happened here? Mm, somebody put microwave dinners in the oven. What kind of an idiot would do something like that? You'd be surprised how my dad gets calls for this sort of thing all the time. He's an electrician. Do you reckon you'd be able to fix the telly? Uh, it's not really my area. I'm sure Layla would really appreciate it. Yeah? Maybe I could take a look at it. I'm thinking it's something to do with the motherboard or the chip inside the motherboard, or it could be unplugged. Dave's much nicer than Matt. And way better looking. You never even met Matt. I don't need to, I just know that he's better. And he's here. And if it is true, I think it's only fair to him that we eat what he does. I don't want to hear it. You hear Noah complaining about having to walk Eddie to his new school? Hi, Dave. Oh. Hi, Layla. It's good to see you. Well, it's fantastic to see you. So, um, how are you? Better now that you're here. OK, can we take this into your room? I don't want to be sick. Um, if you guys need anything, just call. Great skin. I am the repairer of broken hearts. You can call me the love doctor. Hey, Doc, I'd love it for you to get me the glue. Where is it? And don't say the lounge room. No, it's the lounge room floor. <gasps> I really missed you. You did? I'm so glad you're here. So am I. I've missed you so much. If I'd known Matt was going to be such a loser, I never would have dumped you. Oh, that means a lot. <laughs> You're so beautiful. Yeah. You haven't changed a bit. I haven't. It's only been two weeks. I've really missed you, Layla. I couldn't sleep. I couldn't eat. Oh, Dave. Hey, I even got a tattoo done. Look. It says love. Well, yeah, it said Layla last week, but it sort of washed off. Washed off? Yeah, henna tattoo. It lasts like a whole week. That is the most romantic thing I ever heard. Oh, sorry, I've got pizzas to deliver. But, um, text you later? I'll be waiting. <laughs> Took you so long? You're welcome. Hey, losers, where's all the ice cream? You ate it all, remember? And don't you think it's time to clean up? Mum and Dad are going to be home soon. Me? No way. You two made the mess. You can clean it up. She's back. <laughs> Fantastic. Can I smell smoke? Yes, and well spotted. That's our uh, Roman kitchen project. Uh, we wanted it to feel real, you know? What's this? That'd be craft glue. Foaming craft glue. Yeah, uh, foam sticks better. And that's the motto. OK. Well, come on, Hector. I'll run you home, eh? What about the project? Face it, Taylor. We failed. This is pointless. OK, I saw that your light was on. What's happening? Making a Roman kitchen. Looks more like a Roman accident. I'm so sunk.
What are you doing? Well, do you want to get it finished or not, squirt? All that stuff I said about knowing my sister so well that nothing she ever does is surprising. Well, I take it all back. Nice use of materials. I really like how you've captured the rustic look of the ancient Roman kitchen. Yes! That's what we were going for, the rustic look. It's very accurate. We try. What? That's what we were going for, the rustic look. Hey, my voice is not that hot. We need you to reassess Bricky's project. I mean, it's far superior to all the other models. Far superior. Just look at it. This was supposed to be a student project. Stop. This one has clearly been made by the two of you. But we merely advised her. I think it's fair to say that we advised her, but to accuse us of building it ourselves, it's, well, it's preposterous. That's outrageous. We did do the top. And the other. The jugs are too big. What? I told you! My name was Mahatma, and I did not believe in violence. Neither do I. I'll save you, Mahatma Mouse. 